Everybody loves a good deal. All right, turning to the forecast now, let's take a live look over Southfield. In case you didn't notice, it is a gorgeous day out there. And uh, going forward, it sounds like things might continue to be this way. What yeah. Honestly, we are looking at probably at least another five days of weather like we're seeing right now. We'll add in a couple of clouds from time to time, but we are still expecting quite a bit of sunshine. Like today, we do have sunny skies across the area. You can see it here. 85 in Detroit. We're also going to 85 in Lapeer. Mount Clemens, a little bit cooler. How a little bit warmer. Port Huron, the coolest, at least in the region, just with the winds off of the lake, which is currently sitting near 50 degrees. Now, as you take a look here at radar and satellite, nothing going on across the area. We're back to mostly clear skies. We did have a couple of clouds over the last couple of days, but those are now gone at the moment. And those clouds pushed in from a storm system that's continuing to spin along the southeast and along the coastline. There are plenty of rain showers, but for us, we're looking at high pressure. It's Rex blocks that has set up that has kept this high pressure over us, has kept us dry for about nine days now, and we are going to still stay dry as we head through the next couple of days and maybe even for the next seven days plus. So we'll see on that. But we are looking at mostly clear skies across the region right now. As we continue into tonight, we'll keep it mostly clear as we head into tomorrow morning. As many of us head back to work or school, mostly clear skies still expected across the area. Then as we head into the afternoon, you can see a couple showers developing a little bit more instability off to our west. That's where the showers and maybe a thunderstorm will develop. But for us, I do expect us to stay mostly sunny as we head into the afternoon tomorrow and then mostly clear as we head into tomorrow night with more sunshine expected on your Wednesday. So yes, a very summer like forecast continuing over the next few days. Now tonight we'll look at mostly clear skies. Temperatures will be falling close to 60 degrees. A few pockets though even into the mid 50s as you wake up tomorrow morning. By the afternoon tomorrow it's going to be another day very similar to today. I do not expect a big jump in our temperatures like we've been slowly seeing our temperatures climbing. Tomorrow we're going to kind of be about the same 85 for tomorrow afternoon with a lot of sunshine still expected across the area. But as we continue through the next couple of days, that's when our temperatures start to climb. So mid 80 still on Wednesday, so not much of a change there. But Thursday we push 90 degrees. Same thing there on Friday. A couple of clouds trying to pop in, but as we head into Saturday, that'll be our chance for some showers. With that said, though, it's still only a 20% chance and things are kind of shaping up to be potentially even drier. So we may drop that as we continue throughout this week. It does look like at least we'll cool down a bit as we head into this week. And of course, we got the Detroit Grand Prix going on. So mid 80s, more summer like weather. And to put things into perspective, the average high this time of year, 75. So we are running at least 10 degrees warmer than that through the next week. Mike. All right, bring on the heat. Thanks, Marissa.